So this is the last video on the YouTube 10 challenge by Matt Ragland. Um, over the past five weeks, I have posted 10 videos. In the process, I have tried to learn new tools and new processes in order to um, get myself into how to post to YouTube, what are the different ways you can do it, what do I need to learn in order to do it better, and I have learned a lot of things and I've learned that I have a long way to go, but I wanted to summarize at least some of the things that I've learned on this, um, on this journey. And in case other people, you know, find it useful to, to, to see kind of the, the sorts of tools that I learned. So, um, I learned, I was introduced to a, a tool called Descript, which was very interesting where you could, um, record a video and then see the, transcript and when you edit the transcript say you delete a sentence it deletes it out of the video just like a really cool idea and i didn't use it a lot mostly because i saw it eventually i'd have to pay for it and it wasn't something that i was willing to pay for and but it gave me an idea about maybe something that i might be able to write in the future to make a tool that's like that so that's that that you know maybe i'll get to it maybe i won't but it's just a, i just thought it was a really cool idea and uh, um and there should be some i think competition and on that on, on that note um i did a lot of my video editing with um, DaVinci Resolve. I did that because I heard reviews about it, how it was um, as powerful as Adobe Premiere and much more powerful than say iMovie. And I wanted to see what that was all about. So I did a number of videos where I edited those things and it was remarkably simple. Um, it, I watched, I think one introductory video on DaVinci Resolve and could do most of the things that I needed to do. And then the rest of it was just a few little, uh, little details. And again, it's a point where I have learned that I need to learn a lot more, but I, at least I got introduced to that tool. And so that was another one that I, that I, um, that I did. So along the road, making thumbnails and Canva, um, slicing and doing different like A and B roles, looking at, um, what audio, um, I would record from what video do I record my, from my phone or my laptop? These were all things that I kind of looked at. Um, I then, um, learned a little bit of OBS and that was so that eventually I would learn how to do YouTube streaming. I haven't quite gotten that quite yet, but I was able to, um, create selective views so I could look at a particular window and then do, uh, um, you know, my video inside that and, and then, uh, be able to switch between those views very, very easily. So, um, but eventually I want to be able to do YouTube streaming um, from that. That was much more challenging and it took me a while to, to, to learn the basics, um, but definitely worth it. And, 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 and in, in the end made some things uh, much more, uh, much, much, much easier. I learned how to do picture in picture, um, to do a reaction video. And um, I explored kind of the difference between uh, blogging and vlogging by taking some of my old blog posts Posts and changing them into video and seeing how that might how might that that might work. Um, you know, I I tried you know um, to do some educational uh, videos, uh, some reaction videos, and so on. Um, and so I have a long way to go. But I wanted to uh, thank Matt Ragland for this uh, experience. I learned a ton, and I uh, look forward to doing a lot more in the um, in the future. Thank you very much.